I royally freaked myself out. I thought I ruined my refrigerator. So, the other day in our vlog, oh, you can definitely tell, okay, the difference of the two doors. Joel, the other morning, had dropped a bunch of crayons onto the floor from up here by accident, and we didn't realize this, and I sh wish I would have shown you, but I was too frantic to show you. So there was, like, crayon nicks all down the refrigerator right here, and I co we couldn't get it off. First we cleaned the fridge with vinegar and it wasn't taking it off, which that's what we always clean our fridge with. Look at the difference between these two doors. <laughs> so let me get to this part. So then I took Dawn dish soap and I um, grabbed a little piece and I scrubbed, 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 scrubbed like this to get it off. And oh, I finally got it off and I was like so relieved. So then I would wipe this portion off right here. And then you can see I was left with this like splotch on here. And I'll dry it even more. And so then I was even more freaked out because I had this splotch from the Dawn dish soap. And so I thought, okay, maybe I'll go over it with um, vinegar to clean the little splotch off. And um, it wasn't coming off, it was still staying like that. And there is not a difference in the texture um, after I had cleaned it with vinegar. So I thought, great, I just ruined my fridge, discolored it, and I remember one time my kids had taken tape and they had taped a whole bunch of things to the fridge and then when they peeled the tape off, it left a whole bunch of these little guys, like blotches. And so anyway, I was just totally freaked out thinking that when my kids had used tape that it had ruined the fridge. So then I just took the Dawn dish soap and I washed this whole side, but you can see, I just want you to see the difference. You can see how bright and shiny that spot is. You can see how bright and shiny um, this side of my fridge is. <laughs> anyway, so if you want to deep clean your stainless steel appliances, like brighten them up. I thought vinegar brightened them up. That's what I clean. Um, all my appliances with and they look so shiny and new, but they do look darker than they used to So if you want to really deep clean your stainless steel appliances use Dawn dish soap um, <laughs> This is like my favorite thing ever so I'm gonna go through here Ah, so you can even see such a huge difference from far away <gasps> That's insane Oh my gosh, okay. Um, I'm just going to take my Dawn dish soap and I'm going to wash my other side of my fridge. There is a grain to your stainless steel appliances and the grain on this goes this way and I have a stainless steel sink as well and it's interesting, I'll show you, it's gonna be filthy. Which I do my dishes with Dawn dish soap so I just need to use my soapy washcloth to wash my sink. But anyway, I'm gonna show you. You can't really, well yeah, you can tell if I get up close like this. You can tell that the grain goes this way. But then right here on this side of my sink, the grain right here goes up and down. Your appliances will look better and newer if you go with the grain. So that's important to know. It's kind of like with wood. You want to go with the grain of wood when you're dusting it or oiling it or whatever. So I'm just going to go over it a few times like this. I did have to rinse it two or three times. I'll go up the handle so you can see. So this is my soapy washcloth and then I have a clean washcloth that I don't wring out too well. Like I leave it pretty wet so that it will help wash off this soap. <laughs> I am so excited. Don't ask me why. This is very exciting. Very exciting. It still looks kind of dingy. We'll see. Because I haven't dried and polished her up. You just wait. a clean towel and dry. Oh, I think there's still some residue that I can feel. So I'm going to rinse it one more time. 
Boy, howdy, she's ready for her reveal. <laughs> Look at the shiny and new. Okay, she looks good. She looks good. I'm going to show you something that most people don't know about their fridge. Maybe they do, who knows. Um, we had a little mishap in here the other day and you can see there's a whole bunch of stuff underneath the glass. Most people don't know that you can take this tray out. You lift it from the bottom and then you take this glass part out. Then you can clean the top of it and the bottom of it and also in here on these creases. I should have given you a really good before but you'll see the after. And I'm going to take my clean washcloth, the one that does not have soap on it, and I'm going to just wash it with water. And FYI, I would never set the glass directly on my, oh, it's hard to see because it's obviously glass. I would never set my um, glass directly on my sink. I have a washcloth sitting here so that the glass does not scratch up my sink. Um, I think that that is not something most people um, are concerned about, like with pans, if you're washing a pan. I never set my pan directly in my sink. Um, and obviously, every single thing that I am teaching you, I learned from my mom. <laughs> my mom has a really fun YouTube channel. She does a lot of cleaning videos and how-to videos. And let's get real, I'm just copying her, okay? <laughs> so go follow her. I will leave her channel in the description for you guys. She is the ultimate cleaner. Um, and she does some really good how to clean videos, so. Okay, I'm going to set this aside and wipe out the inside of my fridge. And because I know this is going to be very satisfying, we're going to uh, have you follow along with me. Truth be told, I don't even know what this green stuff is. Oh, I'm not even filming it, you guys. Come on, it's not like I've been doing this for six years. Okay, um, satisfying video, here we come. Oh, look at that. Would you look at it? Would you look at it? Oh, and did you see how dirty that was along in here earlier? It's just, it's kind of dirty. And I hate when you, I don't like to push from the center to the corner. I always do from the corner out, otherwise you're gonna get gunky, yucky corners. And yes, I learned that one actually from my dad. He used to say that his mom would say, what? Dang it, now I don't even know. You do the centers and the edges take, if you do the center, the edges take care of themselves, or you do the edges and the center takes care of themselves. Clearly, I was paying so much close attention. Dad, you're gonna have to tell me what that saying was. <laughs> I've said it in a video before, you guys. I've said it in a video before. Um, what is this green stuff? Like, honestly, what is this green stuff? I said it in a video one time when I was cleaning my front window, I remember, and that was several years ago. Look at my washcloth. I bet it's going to stain it. What is this? I can't even tell you what we have had that would have even spilled that was green. How do I not know this? Oh, is that not? I mean, come on. Tell me that doesn't make your day better. And there's like these scuffs from pans and things here in the front that doesn't come up with a washcloth. But if I use a magic eraser, it polishes that up really nice. Maybe I should go slower so you can see. So that wasn't really coming off with a washcloth. You barely go over it with a magic eraser and it comes right off. So in the description below, I will leave a link for magic erasers, Dawn dish soap, and some um, white dish towels because I personally like white to clean with. That's a personal preference. So I'll put them in the description because I like to get those off of Amazon. I'm gonna rinse my rag. I don't know if you guys are having as much fun as I am, but this is fun and I feel very rejuvenated <laughs> doing this video. I'm just gonna finish off because why not? I could take these drawers out and do underneath, but I know that I've done that quite recently, so I'm not going to in this video. But if you wanna clean your fridge, I would take the drawers out, clean under the drawers, and clean in the drawers. 
but mine aren't that bad, so I'm gonna leave them. If I drop this, heaven help me. Okay, we're gonna go really slow so that, so that I don't scratch stuff up and, you know, make a hot mess, okay. I'm just gonna set that back in place. Give her one last polish. Tell me that's not a really great after, a before and after. Come on, so good. Oh, I can go to bed easier now tonight. This is my camera stand for the next shot. I am going to find very much satisfaction by restocking my fridge. Heck yes to the uh, fruit and lettuce and other yummy things here. And that was not planned. This was the most impromptu video I've ever made in my entire life. I feel so happy. You guys, if you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up. If you are new to my channel and you want to subscribe, go ahead and click the subscribe button. And underneath that is the bell notification button. If you click that, you'll be notified of all of our uploads so that you won't miss any content. Um, yeah, guys, clean fridge. See you in my next video. Bye, guys.